hi everyone hope all of you are doing fine so today i'm going to make some very lovely beetroot rice so stay tuned watch and enjoy and also subscribe to my youtube channel for more lovely videos and recipes take care bye got one cup of washed rice that i placed into the rice cooker and then i put uh, two cups of water into that so just like how they make the sushi rice you know after they cook the rice they add in sesame oil and a little bit of vinegar a little bit of sugar and salt into the rice now the rice isn't cooked yet but i'm going to put those ingredients in along with this and cook it up together so we can add in one and a half tablespoons of sesame oil also going to add in some extra flavoring i'm going to add in one teaspoon of cardamom powder half teaspoon of cinnamon powder just trying to uh, flavor the rice you know you can even add star anise or cloves or whole uh, cinnamon stick and then take it off at the end once you finish cooking i'm going to add in two tablespoons of vinegar into that half tablespoon of sugar this is optional some people don't like it you can skip it but normally when uh, you know once sushi rice is cooked they add in the salt and sugar to balance the taste up and we can season it with a little bit of salt that's it place it off into the rice cooker turn it on let it cook up nicely okay i've got 425 grams of beetroot that i chopped up the two green chilies into that that i've chopped up as well season it with a little bit of salt so these are boiled beetroot. If you're using raw beetroot, just boil it in a little bit of water. I'm going to add one tablespoon of vinegar into this. Next, we can combine this up nicely. So this in itself is called the basic beetroot salad. So you can use this as a side dish. You can add in, uh, you know, a few more green chilies if you want. But these are very spicy green chilies as well. I'm just sticking with two but you know you can serve this up on the side and it's a beetroot salad but what i'm going to do is i'm going to infuse this in along with the rice check for taste and make sure it's got that um, you know nice kick of vinegar and it's also got sufficient amount of salt yep that's perfect and amazing it's got that nice kick of the vinegar it's got sufficient amount of salt and it's also got that little um, spicy kick of the green chilies coming through. Now I'm just waiting for the rice to cook up nicely. Okay, so it looks like our rice is ready. Let's have a look. Nice and lovely. I'm going to plate this up in layers. So first I'm going to put one layer of rice. We can go ahead and put our beetroot layer into that. I'm going to put another layer of rice on top of that. The next layer of beetroot. I'm going to top this off with the final layer of rice. There we are, just garnish it with some beetroot in the center. So now let's plate it up. There we are. You can see the layers when we try to serve it. So look at it, everyone. So it's got some beetroot, some chili. And ahead and place it off into this bowl. So how colorful is that? So nice, isn't it? Look at it, so lovely. Just press it down to the back of the spoon and then I'm gonna plate this up. So I've just put this bowl upside down into another big bowl. There we go. So here it is. So when you dig into this rice, look at it, how nicely it's falling apart see nice and lovely cheers it's super that beetroot salad the lovely um, vinegar and that beetroot combination is perfect in terms of the rice adding in that sesame oil that's so amazing the flavors are so good it's amazing and there it is everyone so it's looking nice and lovely so this is our uh, beetroot rice along with it i made some chicken nibble curry so that will be on my youtube channel as well but here it is our lovely beetroot rice so it's nice lovely and it's ready subscribe to my youtube channel for more lovely videos and recipes take care enjoy bye Hope all of you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for more lovely videos and recipes. Take care. Bye.